The governor's political hiring practices came under fresh fire today. Albuquerque Republican Senator Sue Wilson Bufford introduced a measure requiring that hand placed political appointees be the first laid off when an agency's budget is overspent. News 13's investigative reporter Larry Barker has been revealing Richardson's abuses of political hiring practices, and tonight Ian Swartz uncovers another. Governor Richardson ordered a statewide hiring freeze in 2008 in response to the state's budget crisis. When you keep hiring people and after the freeze date, then obviously uh, somebody's not paying attention to what they're supposed to be doing. One of those people hired by the governor long after the freeze is Danette Wood. Wood was hired late last year as a special projects coordinator for the state's economic development department. Her salary, $65,000. Wood has business experience. She says she was appointed to the state's investment council by Governor Gary Johnson in 2001 and then reappointed by Governor Richardson in 2003, then worked in the private sector in real estate. Her new boss, Tony Balzano, explains what Wood does now. Everything from standing up gateways for the supercomputer um, to working on the application, the um, computer application center. The only exceptions to the hiring freeze were supposed to be for essential positions dealing with health and public safety. So why would the Department of Economic Development hire Wood for a non-essential position? Well, they didn't. She is an exempt employee, and so therefore she works for the governor and was sent to the department by the governor. That job was handpicked by Bill Richardson. Paul Wood gave thousands to Richardson for his run for governor in 2006 and his presidential run in 2008. Balzano says Wood's job at economic development is necessary, though. We've lost several people from that division uh, over the course of time. And so, yes, uh, her position was needed. Lawmakers on both sides of the aisle have told us Richardson's hiring practices have undermined their work to fix the budget mess. We come up here and give, you know, you know, you know, hundreds of thousands of dollars in, in projects back, only to find that the governor is offering jobs to people, paying, uh, you know, almost $100,000 with benefits and everything, uh, negating everything we've done. There's things that are important sometimes in government, but you know, we have to make sure where we're spending money, and we don't need to hire any extra people. As to the reasons why Governor Richardson hired Danette Wood after the hiring freeze, we do not know. The governor's office did not return our call back for comment. Back to you. Okay, Ian. Now to see all of Larry Barker's investigations into the governor's hiring practices, go to krqe.com, then scroll down to the Larry Bar Barker section.